please welcome U.S. Poet Laureate Joy Harjo. Henje Stongo, everyone. There is so much to consider. Many stories have been shared in the last few days. Um, many stories have been shared. Many of these stories have roots that are much longer than the founding of this country. They give us a sense of timeless place and meaning. Others are shorter rooted stories born of urgent need fed by the spark of connections, ideas, and ears that hear. You will need time and silence to carefully step forward in a time that urges us to move faster and faster. Remember, as you return to your home circles at the end of this gathering to call yourself back, sit by the fire, listen, ask for help from those who bring inspiration and wisdom. We will find the right way to help in the search for truth for solutions to navigate the challenges we face of a changing earth. We must garner the foresight in all local and national policymaking to do what is right for all of us who share this home of Iganajaga or Mother Earth. And so I'm gonna read this poem, Eagle Poem. I was thinking about it because this is a summit is one meaning of the word and summit is also a highest peak. And we go to those peaks in our imagination, um, in real time, so that we can get a sense of context to see further, farther than we can usually see. And of course, the eagle, who um, is a, birds are messengers, and the eagle is the kind of messenger that brings that kind of context. So I offer this poem uh, to you and to, for, this, uh, for this gathering, this gathering, at a summit in a time when we need our wisest leaders to, uh, to work together. And I think everyone is ultimately a kind of leader. That's what we're working towards. Ego poem, to pray, you open your whole self to sky, to earth, to sun, to moon, to one whole voice that is you. And know that there is more that you can't see, can't hear, can't know, except in moments steadily growing. And in languages that aren't always sound, but other circles of motion. Like eagle, that Sunday morning over salt river, circled in blue sky and wind, swept our hearts clean with sacred wings. We see you see ourselves and know that we must take the utmost care and kindness in all things. Breathe in, knowing we are made of all this and breathe knowing we are truly blessed because we were born and die soon within a true circle of motion. Like eagle rounding out the morning inside us, we pray that it will be done in beauty, in beauty. Meadow, thank you.